Hey, Cyrus, good morning. Hello, Chelsea. Thank you so much for the time. Really appreciate it. Oh, absolutely. Thanks for having us this morning. Okay, okay. glad to do it. We're going to go ahead and start the taping for you, okay? Okay. Welcome to Conversations Live. For more than a decade, we've brought you the best in books, entertainment, celebrity interviews, and current events. When the movers and shakers of the world have something to say to you, they say it to us first. Here's your host, Cyrus Webb. And welcome back, everyone, to Conversations Live. I'm your host, Cyrus Webb. Glad you all could join us once again, both for our radio audience here in Mississippi at WYAD 94.1 FM and WYADonline.com. We're glad that you all could be with us. Also, it's tuning in to our online affiliates around the world. Thanks to our friends at iHeartRadio and Amazon Music Podcast. Glad you all could be with us as well. We have all heard the saying, all things old are new again, and this definitely fits our next segment. There is a new Pac-Man in town. But it's not the Pac-Man that I grew up with. This one, like so many things that we're doing today, is not only social, but something that all of us can be a part of. It's part of Facebook's gaming system. And we're excited to welcome to our program today Chelsea Cross. You know her not only as a marketing strategist, author, and media personality, but she's going to talk to you guys about how people are being able to socialize around video games online and how this is something that you guys can be a part of when it comes to the Pac-Man community. Chelsea, thank you so much for the time. really appreciate it. Good morning. Thanks so much for having me this morning. Uh, the pleasure is definitely all mine. So for our audience that may just be finding out about this, Chelsea, how is the Pac-Man community different from the Pac-Man that I grew up with when I was playing it? Oh, yeah. Well, I'm so excited to tell you about the all-new take on, of course, one of the most iconic video games of all time, Pac-Man. This is a game that everyone knows how to play, but traditionally, it was a pretty individual experience, right? So now, innovative game producer Genvid has joined forces with Facebook Gaming as a part of their new Play, Watch, Connect framework, and they've created Pac-Man Community, the most social and shareable adaption ever. So what makes it different is a few things. And first, there's a cooperative play where you can actually invite up to three friends to team up with you to battle the ghosts. And with many people not able to gather in person during the holidays, it's a great way to spend time together in a game everyone already knows how to play. And secondly, in addition to the cooperative play uh, mode, there's another unique part of Pac-Man, which is the watch mode. And in this mode, you and endless amounts of other fans can watch an artificial intelligence Pac-Man and ghosts race through 3D mazes. And there's a bit of a twist to that as well. Every viewer can impact the action by clicking to power up Pac-Man or his enemies. So you can help or hurt Pac-Man in a live <laughs> video broadcast. Wow, that is amazing, Chelsea. And something, that, again, you know, because gaming is something that so many people enjoy, and then, of course, being able to do this uh, with other people is, is so exciting. So I guess an obvious question would be for our audience, Chelsea, is how do players create their own mazes and be a part of this? So this is another fun and innovative feature for Pac-Man community. There's a maze maker tool, and it's a fun way to express your Pac-Man creativity and share the Pac-Man love with your Facebook connections and the entire gaming community on Facebook. I actually made a maze for my grandmother and another for my mom, and we just had the best time playing it together, wow. especially while I'm down here in Florida and my grandmother's up in New York. You you know, I'm still getting them festive holiday gifts, but this was a really fun and festive and more personalized way to spend time together and play a game that we all love. And, you know, it's, it's, it brings back that nostalgia from, from my childhood, my grandmother's childhood, my mom's childhood. Everybody has memories playing Pac-Man. Love that, Chelsea. So I guess an obvious question would be also for our audience as they're kind of listening to us talk about this and, and think about the idea that they can actually create their own mazes. How do they get it? How do they become a part of the Pac-Man community? It is super easy. So all you need to do is open up your Facebook app on your mobile device, PC, or tablet, and search Pac-Man community or in the games, just right uh, in, this, in the game section, just search for Pac-Man and it will pop up 
It is available for everyone on Facebook worldwide. There is no download or installation required. It's truly instantly available on Facebook. And another bonus is it's totally free. Really, no purchase, no microtransactions, no subscription. There are no quarters needed for this version of Pac-Man. <laughs> hey, that is a definitely a plus. Chelsea, this is just some exciting news as people are getting together. And even for those who can't be physically together, this is a great way for us to be able to engage with one another. Again, everyone, we're excited to welcome Chelsea to our program to be able to talk to us about the Pac-Man community. Uh, Chelsea, again, thank you so much for being with us and looking forward to speaking with you again. Thank you. Have fun playing, everyone. Okay, thank you for that. And we thank your audience for tuning in to another great segment of Conversations Live here at WYAD 94.1 FM, WYADonline.com, as part of our News You Can Use segment here. Until next time, I'm your host, Cyrus Webb, saying, as always, enjoy your day, enjoy your life, enjoy your world. Thank you all for choosing Conversations Live. Now let's go make today amazing. Take care.